How's it going everyone? My name is Michael SK and welcome back to Persona 5 Royal. We are in the new section of Mementos, which has been uh, fiddled with, as you could uh, kind of see. I like the white atmosphere. It's a little better than the dark that we've been seeing for all the floors. So it's, a, it's a little different, you know? Jamie, you were just about to watch Attack on Titan. Bro, go watch that shit. That's better than this. 100%. I actually watched that earlier. That was beautiful. This is just going to be a grind session for the most part. We're going to continue on here as we try to figure out what the hell is going on here in the first place. Because whenever we get to the end, I need to go back through and get all these stamps for this boy. So that's really all this is going to be. It's just a grind session. A lot of shadows in this area. Proceed carefully, Joker. Thank you, Futaba. You know, just uh, see what's going on here. So it's just going to be a big fat, you know, grind session. Nothing nothing too crazy that's going to be happening here, as far as I can tell. Perfect timing there. Damn. Yeah, I know. I've been going up instead of down. Did I say down on accident? Regardless, we're, we're progressing. That's all that matters. And don't worry. There's, there's not going to be any attack on Titan... Spoilers here. All right, level up. Persona spoilers, yes, but none of those uh, Attack on Titan spoilers. It was already hard for me to believe palaces existed, but to think there's such a massive one under Shibuya, it's not all that different from the real world. The Tokyo subway system is bonkers. I oh, believe it, Mister. What the? Hey, good job. Looks like this area was formed somewhat recently. I believe it. I haven't learned much of anything about this place yet, so I need to drink some more flowers. Ah. Hmm. The flavor has this. No. I'm here for my studies. Who is this kid? I swear. Hi. Like, I. <laughs> the fuck? I hope we get to figure that out soon. Alright, we'll get some sort of change at least. Um, so there's 12 more here. I'm assuming 8, or no, 12 more here. So 24 more stamps to go, or maybe 25. Is that how this is looking? Uh, 26 to go, so I guess the items will increase a little bit. The characters... Wait. You won't, but I would. Oh shit! Okay, so you're you are throwing a uh, Attack on Titan spoiler out there that they're breathing. She. We made it to the. But nah. The uh, the most recent episode has to be one of my favorites in all anime. I don't know if all media, but then again, my uh, my media consumption isn't exactly that insane. But the new episode is really good. If any of you guys watching this episode don't watch Attack on Titan, please give it a try. It's not like your average shonen shit. It really is something special. A, uh, a modern classic, if you will. And I say this as a guy who has grown out of that Naruto and shonen phase. I see all these uh, new episodes of Boruto coming out. And I'm just like, wow, this looks literally terrible. Sorry to the people watching this episode that like Boruto, by the way. We've reached the but let me ask you this. Why? You know? Why? How was work, by the way, Jamie? In the last episode, you were uh, Whenever at work. I travel, I always end up buying some sort of good luck charm. Yup. Impulse buys are all too real. Yeah, she did buy a charm whenever we were in Hawaii, so that that is true. I like hearing the new statements from Sumi and Akechi. Oh, just one stamp here. Your legs hurt. Yeah, you do a lot of standing on for your work. I do a lot of sitting. It really hurts my back. And here I am, sitting. I'm not really helping anything. But I guess that's office work. And I guess I can't complain. Being on your legs is harder. You know what? There was an Akechi line that came up, and I completely, like, fucked it up by going into the pause menu like an idiot. 
Are you talking about the brainwash one? I have not been brainwashed. I've been electrocuted by myself before. We're at the platform. That has indeed happened. Embarrassingly so, but it happened. God damn. How many fucking areas are there? There's Jose again. I guess we can give him the stamps we have. These boys are very creepy. I don't really know if I commented too much on them last time. Other than them being different, obviously. They're not your normal mementos goons. But then again, not really sure what those things were either. Not like much is different, I guess. It's just these guys have tentacles. You were definitely right about something, Jamie. A lot more tentacles going on at this point of the game for some reason. I don't know why, but that's definitely a thing. The Akechi line. Level 85. I can never imagine myself playing the original Persona 5 ever again. And I hate that. I really hate that. We made it. Because like that is like the game, but this is just more definitive. It's it's much more well put together. He references the one thing that became the downfall. You are tired. I mean, this isn't the first time you've ever confused me with your uh, your. Wait, what's going on here? Hey, good job. Thanks. This isn't quite the same flavor I was told about. Told about. It tastes. Oh, his downfall in vanilla P5. Oh, it's the line that lets you know what happened. Oh. Hmm. I learned that a person's sense of taste will change as they get older. Is that true? Has it happened to you? Um, yeah, actually, kind of. I see. It's not like that for everyone, huh? I just can't bring myself to like the flowers here. And I used to like drinking them so much, too. If I don't succeed in my studies, then wait. I have to focus. Who even is this guy? Hi. Like, I really would like to know that. I'd like that mystery to be, you know, somewhat solved here. Okay, so yeah. Two more fives, a 12, so 17 left to go. Oh, wait. No, I'm losing a five here. 22 to go. Sorry, my math is not good today. Either is my counting, which is bad because that is required at work. The ability to count and all that. I think it's every seven years that your tongue changes some of its taste. I mean, I've noticed it with like, you know, the food and and drinks that I consume, you know? Doing good. It's something I don't like. Oh, whoa, 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 what's happening here? Okay. Oh. Cognitive control room. Okay. See what this is about. I hope this doesn't kick me out of mementos. Whoa. You know, whatever's about to happen here. The hell is this place? There's tons of computery stuff all over. This is the center data hub. This room's most likely where the data is sent over from the palace. Wait, this room's most likely where the data is sent over from the palace goes. Sorry, read that wrong. Hey, what's on the screen? Various locations within mementos. I presume this is less about surveillance and more looking for targets. Although, yeah, it is a new, uh, new area here. Think about it. While all sorts of unnatural events may be taking place in Maruki's, re Maruki's reality, that doesn't mean every human's wish has already been granted. That's a good point. If everyone's wishes were already made into reality, there wouldn't be any requests on the fan site. Yes. Exactly. Therefore, Maruki is likely choosing certain targets with the system, and then affecting each one individually. Probably using the same method as when he made Violet's persona go berserk that one time. Huh? What, me? From what I remember, Dr. Maruki summoned these things that look like tendrils, and they grabbed me. 
Wait, don't tell me. Are these... <laughs> yeah. Indeed. These are the something Dr. Maruki is using to affect the minds of others. Such as Violet, for example. <sighs> yes, that hypothesis explains much of what we've seen if it were found to be true. Maruki is extending these cables from his own palace, tunneling into the depths of Mementos, and spreading his influence from the same place the Holy Grail once occupied. That allows him to grant the wishes of any people he may discover once they've fallen under his influence. <laughs> Screw that. Uh-huh. This won't much or this won't last much longer now that we're here. <laughs> but I'm the one who has to do the actual hacking though. Access by consultation subject confirmed. Temporarily suspend research data stream. Huh? What's that supposed to mean? Well, the displays are showing parts of Mementos, right? I guess we can suspend something here. Yeah, well, fuck it. True that. You got it. I like the way you think. Oh. Yeah, that, that done diddly did it. Research data stream suspended. Retracting pipelines. To resume data streaming. Yeah, go ahead and shut up now. We ain't resuming shit. <laughs> Hentai tentacles, yeah. Does this bring us any closer to stopping Maruki? Mm. All we did was suspend the data sharing. Stopping Maruki is a whole other story. I don't think this will interfere with his effect on mementos. What? Then what good does suspending the data stream do us? According to this console's output, all the cable tendrils are retracted now. Possibly including some place in the palace that was blocked before. We won't know unless we check it out for ourselves. Let's say we head to the palace next. Yeah, we've done what we can here. Next on our agenda, a return to Maruki's palace. Oh, okay. Well, that was pretty straightforward. I thought something was gonna, like, happen here, but no. That, that was that. Looks like those cables went away after we cut off the data transfer. We should be able to get past that one spot in the palace now. Let's go. Guess we'll have to see for ourselves. Let's get back to the palace infiltration. Yeah, we will. Focus. It doesn't look like there's anything else in here, so I guess that was really it. We can just dip out here, it seems. Thing is, we actually need to, uh... Yeah, I guess this is now the true end of Mementos. We need to go back through and actually do a little bit of grinding. And I was gonna ask, Jamie, I don't know if you're interested, being like the major viewer here, would you be interested in seeing me attempt to fight the Reaper? I don't know if we'll be coming back to Mementos at all now, but you know, who knows? This may be our final trip to Mementos. I don't know if there's gonna be any other reason to be I've here. Been waiting for you. Please be aware that there Okay, I know what I want to make here. I would like to make Michael. Y you know me. It seems to have a decent amount of strength. This is a, a big boy. I have the big money. Select a skill to inherit. And I'll probably give it stupid shit. Because that's, you know, what I do. Hmm. You think it'd be worth trying to fight the Reaper? I'd probably go through Make sure we get all the stamps and make sure we're good to go. Get us some more level ups as well. I don't mind trying it out. That'd be pretty interesting. Hmm. Fuck it. Ooh. Nah, that's tight. I'm down with this. Fuck that. Fuck that. And this could be useful. I'll get rid of Diamond Dust. Cosmic Flare. Uh... I mean, that could be helpful. I'll get rid of Heat Riser. Alright. Oh, we could try to make Metatron. It seems to have a decent amount of speed. Yeah, if we really wanted to. Nah, I'll wait till the next alarm. The alarm. I will be back to uh, make more personas oh. without the alarm. As is tradition of me being a puss. We're level 85 now, so we can 
We can make these boys without any, like, worry, I guess. You still haven't seen the new ReZero episode? It was pretty good, too. I swear, like, I love anime. <laughs> like, these episodes just really, you know, make me realize, goddamn, like, this shit good. It's insane. I guess that's another thing. I recommend to all my viewers to give ReZero a try. It may seem a little weird at first, but boy, it's pretty good. It is pretty tight. ReZero and Attack on Titan are one. Oh, dude, 100% on that one, brother. Like, it's like no doubt. Absolutely. No doubt in my mind with that one. Like, they, they are really different in genre, but they are both really fantastic. Oh, hey! Promoted Claymore. Thank you for the subscription. I'm so sorry I don't have my uh, alerts on right now, but uh, thank you. That's my buddy, Colton. We, uh, we work together. It's, uh, it's insane. Oh, wait. Oh. Oh! I didn't even see the message. Colton actually said something. I didn't even see that. Okay, so when he subscribed, he said, Thoughts on Shark Boy and Lava Girl 2. I actually never, um, I actually never really thought too much about it in the first place. I need to save my game. Let's do it. I mean, I saw that they're doing like a series or some shit, like some sort of superhero series, and they're involved in it. And it's not even the right Shark Boy. Also, why are they parents? That's that's not right. That wasn't how it was supposed to be. Or at least, like, I never got that vibe in the first place. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Colton. You really you, you really knew how to cheat the system there. <laughs> I forgot we uh, have each other on here. That's how, uh, how much I don't use my PS4. Oh, no, he didn't dox himself. That wasn't his actual last name. See, I, I know what his last name is, and it ain't that. So he's okay. No worries. But thank you, Colton. Thank you for the... Thank you for subscribing regardless. Yeah, you had your real name on there at one point. I remember that. And I did too, but then I got the old... Capture card and... Oh, you actually had your name come up on the screen before. But you gotta be careful now because this is also a uh, recording session. This is going up on the old YouTube channel. I actually remember Colton way back in the day. I think before, um, shoot. Before I kind of gave up on playing on my PS4 a lot, it was back when I lived at the old place with the shitty internet. I was talking with you and, uh... Yesterday and I ended up buying everything they had. Who, shoot. Everything? Who were we talking with? It was you... It was somebody else. Well, no, I don't, I don't know, like, what specifically we were talking about, but... I remember I was playing this game, but it was the original. Oh, Star Wars? Now, that's when you came over. Hear the search <laughs> yeah, remember the, the Star Wars playthrough we did together that's still on my channel, Colt? Remember that? Let's do this. Let's do oh, this. Oh yes. Come on. Alright, Colton. Tell your girlfriend that I said hi, despite the fact that she doesn't know me. And thanks for stopping by. Thanks for the subscription. What a letdown. Good work, everyone. That was hot. All right. I don't know why we were in that fight. To be totally honest. I know, showing off that he has a girlfriend. How dare he? I mean, if I had a girlfriend right now, I'd probably say the same shit. At the end of the session, I'd be like, all right, guys. I'm done. Forever. Another cutscene with Jose. Hey, good job. Remember how I told you I just couldn't bring myself to like the flowers here? Well, I think I know why now. 
The flowers here taste sort of staticky. I don't really like it. Since these flowers are... Hmm... How to phrase it like someone in the real world? Ah, right! It's the cognition of oneself, which everyone has inside themselves. When the flavor gets staticky, like with these, that means the self is uncertain of its own cognition. Can people really not know what they are? Is everyone like that? I don't get it. This is nothing like what I've been taught. But I can't quit my studies now. What exactly is he studying for? Hi. You gonna be a velvet room assistant or some shit? I guess we did have enough. Get some more uh, items. Alright, now we have 17 more to go. I think. 16 plus one more to go? We made it Wait, to what do you mean? Floor. It's 17 more to go, right? That's how many more stamps we have. That's how many we have more to get. Funny makes for a pretty good workout, doesn't it? Yeah, it really makes you work up a sweat. Uh, anyways, as I was saying earlier with uh, Colton, it's not an embarrassing story. I just remember we were talking with somebody. Hella just chilling here in a party chat, and I was uh, I was playing the base game. I was actually just grinding in mementos, like literally sitting here, like trying. God damn. Like, sitting here just trying to grind levels, grind money, grind treasure. But that's what that is, Jamie. That's literally what that is. I might just say fuck it at some point and... Like, despite not getting all of the, uh, the stamps... Just probably go fight that fucking Reaper. Freaking me out here, man. At least you're able to still do math. They were too weak to be a threat. Okay, no more cutscenes with him. What do you want? No more cutscenes. That was interesting, though. I'm glad we got to see all those. I hate missable cutscenes. It uh, makes me anxious. If you get more stamps, you might get more cutscenes. Ah, yeah, maybe. I mean, this is this is the part that sucks because like, you really have to just backtrack. You know, you actually hadn't gotten all the stamps. So I guess it really just is a mystery here. The tracks just keep going. I'd wager this runs longer than the real subway. Hard to say. God damn it! I was listening to that. Not one here either. Rest area, so we can go back and make personas. Okay, so because I really don't have that much time left, I do want to, you know, just relax for the night. Um, we're gonna fuse something here. I don't know what that will be. I've been waiting for you. Please be aware. Be prepared for we could do an advanced fusion. At once. I really wish we could do Yoshitsune, but... Oh well. We could do this. It seems to have a decent amount of strength. We could just make this big-ass boy. We have the money for it, so I guess fuck Select it. A skill to inherit. Why not? Oh, so beautiful. Goodbye, Michael. Hello, this guy. Now we'll go fight the Reaper. It's magical, man. It's, it's fucking great. I'll keep that as is. But what do we get here? We get some Almighty. Almighty is always good. We'll get rid of that. Hama boost. Uh, now we okay. Concentrate. Now nah, we okay. Bless amp. And yeah, we actually might want that. Alright, goodbye fire. Divine judgment. Fuck that. Alright, and there we go. Our new big boy. Let's get the fuck out of here. Yeah, let's uh, let's leave. Okay, Reaper time. I should write something. We'll uh we'll save it. I'll figure out what lineup I want here. For a Persona, it'd be, um... Oh, we can start with this guy. Or we can use this guy. Nah, we'll start with Fafnir. Um... Let's see. Let us see. I don't want Yusuke. I definitely want Makoto. I'll start with Akechi. I won't have Sumi. And I will have... Ryuji. That seems pretty tight. Okay, let's uh, let's go for it. 
I don't think it really matters where we go for it. So we'll just, uh, we'll go off of here. I'll save it again, actually, now that I made, the, like, all these adjustments. I have never in my life actually beat the Reaper legitimately. I always, you know, cheated, I guess you could say. I'll send you the results. I use despair, basically. All right, well, I guess we can just run around here. Uh, we can also fight this. Time to run around and just wait for the boy to show up. I don't know. I mean, I feel pretty confident. I mean, it's going to be kind of fucked, if I remember correctly. He's just going to use every trick under the table to deal with our ass. It's just we need to get the drop on him. That's the thing, because I remember he's going to look around for you, where you actually want to be the one that gets to him first. You don't want to be in a situation ah, where you're getting is. fucked in the ass. Well, should we head back up? I've been going outside a lot more, so now I'm sleeping way better than I did when I was a shut-in. Maybe you should try exercising more regularly to build up your stamina. Yes. Jamie, did you ever beat the uh, the Reaper? Legitimately or not? Open up all the doors. Actually, the uh, the Reaper scared me one time back in Persona 4. Persona 4 Golden, that is. I didn't think that, you know, he was going to show up, but uh, if you stay on the floor too long, same thing here. You know, he just eventually shows up. It's creepy. It is very, very creepy. You beat him in New Game Plus? What level were you, if you don't mind me asking? I mean, he's going to give you a lot of XP if you are able Choco to beat him. so cool when he uses that grappling hook. He's so talented. I'm almost envious. Yeah, I never fought him in... Persona 4 Golden either. Well, you haven't really gotten through all of it, but even at the end game, like, I was just... I really didn't want to fight his ass. I really didn't. You think I'm frightening when I fight? Well, I'm afraid you're just going to have to accept it. But it's just so different from how you normally are. Which one's the real you? I think we know the answer to that question there, Makoto. I think we do. I hope he doesn't spawn in this room. Uh, I'm about to beat the game I've been playing. Wonder what I should play next. Man, whenever I beat a game, I never decide whether I want to replay it or start a new game. <laughs> what the fuck was that, Ryuji? What the hell? Ah, uh, okay, I see. We're working under the constraints of a time limit, so I'd appreciate it if you could be more efficient. Sorry. I understand your concern, but our safety is just as important as our efficiency. Hmm? Uh-oh, here we go. Joker. All right, let's go find his ass. Caution. That's not him over there. I probably should have gotten rid of more of the chat. There he is. There is that son of a bitch. Here we go. Whoa. All right, so he's focused. He's gonna use that uh, right off the bat. Holy shit. God damn. Okay. Right off the fucking bat. Wow. Okay. Fantastic. Fantastic. How do I want to go about this? Let's get our new boy out. So we can debilitate his ass. Maybe. Is that, is that a good idea? Yeah, let's debilitate him. Bro, this is gonna be fucking hard. I'm gonna use Vault Guardian, our, our famous trick up the sleeve. Oh, this is, this is gonna be so much fun here. I think it might take a while too, now that I think about it. It may take some time. Okay. We need to heal the fuck up. <laughs> like, ASAP. Need this? I appreciate it. I've already used Debilitate. I need to put that on a catchy from now on. Alright, let's get fucking pumped up here. Yeah. Nice try, bucko. But we ready this time. There we go. Hell yeah. A lot better there. Okay. 
Hold up, I need to think here. Who has the, uh... Who has the good fucking ability that I want? Not that one. Maybe it's Yusuke. Yeah, we're gonna need Yusuke out. Okay, so I'm gonna bring in Yusuke. Sorry, Akechi. I can debilitate with the uh, Akira now. So, it's all good. I guess I could have gotten rid of Makoto. Okay, what do I want to do? Yeah, wait. Why don't I just do that? So we can keep Akechi out to, de to do the debilitation and I can just attack. Okay, fuck that. I am indecisive, as you guys can tell. Alright, let's get a big fucking attack in here with Ryuji. Or at least I hope we will. Ice break, that's great. Uh-oh. Aha! Nice. Alright, let's, uh, let's get this shit going. Oh, wait, I should have used Debilitate, huh? That did not do a lot, unfortunately. We could use Debilitate here. Uh-oh. Okay, so that's what I'm weak to with this guy. I should keep that in mind. Thank you, Akechi. That would have killed me. God damn. Thank you, Futaba. Damn, we low on that health. Okay. What can we do differently here? We need to do a physical attack. We're just gonna have to get some physical attacks in, I guess. I'll heal with Yusuke. This is gonna take some time, but we'll uh, we'll scrape away. We'll we'll get it done. Sorry. I just need to. I just need to concentrate and keep track of uh, how many turns the debilitate and everything are on. Oh. You look pumped up. Let's do this. I actually don't know if that's a good idea to use this showtime, so I'm going to uh, say no to this one. I need to keep our uh, stats up. Very important here. Watch your health. They're there. coming. No time for thanks. Keep our heels up. Nice try. Nice try. God damn it, I keep forgetting to change my persona. I'm gonna screw myself over at this rate. See? 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 I could have been death right there. I need to change my persona like ASAP. God damn it, as much as I really want to do this. Hold up, let me change my persona. Have it on this boy. Alright, let's do it. Just because it's you, Akechi. It has to be done. Oh my god, that did so much fucking damage. Why? Why did that do so much fucking damage? Alright, let's try using Curse on it. Not, not a lot done there. I lend it! And there we go. All right. According to plan. That wasn't that terrible. That was pretty good. I leveled this up a lot. I actually did not see uh, how much XP that gave us, but we went up from 86 to 89, and okay. we did it legitimately. I can still fight. Let us. Okay, let's get the fuck out of here. <laughs> that was good. That was good. I feel like that worked out really, really well. Let's do it. Alrighty. So we will save it on that. The next session, we will continue the grind for stamps. I will record it just in case anything happens. And then we will jump out of here and go into Maruki's Palace. Thank you, Jamie, for being able to come by. Go ahead and watch your uh, episode of Attack on Titan now. Thank you all for watching this episode. If you enjoyed, be sure. Oh, excuse me. Be sure to leave a like. Subscribe, all that fancy jazz, and I will see you guys next time. Take it easy.